Testing one, two, testing one, two.
Dear friends and families, we are gathered here to witness and to celebrate the marriage of Kyle Mocha and Melanie Brochu and to be with them as they pledge themselves to each other. Who is giving this woman to be married to this man? Thank you, and you may be seated. Kyle and Melanie, your partnership is freely chosen and founded on love, friendship, trust, and respect. It is a partnership that encourages not only self-expression, understanding, and the development of wisdom through the sharing of knowledge, but also an enthusiasm for life and living. It must be done with respect, consideration, and a deep and gentle caring for one another. You are the people with whom they want to share their joy as they enter into marriage, and they hope that in the years ahead, your love will be a continuous source of strength for them. Let us now celebrate the union of Kyle and Melanie and bless them in their bond of love. Now, Kyle and Melanie, you are here today with your closest family and friends to publicly declare your love for one another. Do you now pledge to treat each other with kindness, respect, and compassion, to listen to each other, and to speak to each other always with honesty? We do. We do. Your marriage is an act of faith which must not be entered into lightly, nor must it be based upon the vain hope of what the other will do or not do, might become or not become. It must be based on the firm belief in your individual worth and in that of the other, remembering that the pledge that you make here today will only remain valid as long as you look upon it, not as a license to control, but as an expression of your devotion and freedom. Today, you are dedicating yourselves to that most fragile of all endeavors, a human relationship. The words spoken in this ceremony will not validate your marriage unless your love and your commitment to one another are strong enough to sustain it. Kyle, in the presence of these witnesses here today, will you now have Melanie as a part of your life? Will you love her, care for her, and respect her? Will you promise to cherish her in honesty, tenderness, and faithfulness for as long as you both shall live? Melanie, in the presence of these witnesses here today, will you now have Kyle as a part of your life? Will you love him, care for him, and respect him? Will you promise to cherish him in honesty, tenderness, and faithfulness for as long as you both shall live? I will. Please repeat after me. Melanie. Melanie. I take you as my wife. I take you as my wife. To love, cherish, and respect. To love, cherish, and respect. I promise to share my life openly with you. I promise to share my life openly with you. I promise to tenderly care for you. I promise to tenderly care for you. I promise to encourage you. I promise to encourage you. In the fulfillment of your dreams. In the fulfillment of your dreams. And your individuality. And your individuality. Throughout the changes in our lives. Throughout the changes in your li our lives. <laughs> Kyle. Kyle. I take you as my husband. I take you as my husband. To love, cherish, and respect. To love, cherish, and respect. <laughs> I promise okay. to share my life openly with you. I promise to share my life openly with you. I promise to tenderly care for you. I promise to tenderly care for you. I promise to encourage you. <laughs> I promise to encourage you. In the fulfillment of your dreams. In the fulfillment of your dreams. And your individuality. And your individuality. Throughout the changes in our lives. Throughout the changes in our lives. And the rings, please. Oh, 
The uh, uh, actually switch. <laughs> the uh, perfect circle of a ring symbolizes eternity. In the days and years to come, Kyle and Melanie, may these rings remind you of the overwhelming joy of this very special occasion when you are united in marriage here this day. Kyle, place this on your lovely bride's finger and repeat after me, Melanie. Melanie. With all my love. With all my love. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. An everlasting symbol. An everlasting symbol. Of the vows that we have made. Of the vows we have made. In the presence of these witnesses. In the presence of these witnesses. I honor you. I honor you. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. And place this on his finger and repeat after me, Kyle. With all my love, With all my love I, give I give you this ring, an everlasting symbol, an everlasting symbol of, the vows that we have made. of the vows that we have made. In the presence of these witnesses, I honor you with all that I am and all that I have. Edmund O'Neill said marriage is a commitment to life, the best that two people can find and bring out in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other relationship can equal. It is a physical and an emotional joining that is promised for a lifetime. Within the circle of its love, marriage encompasses all of life's most important relationships. A wife and a husband are each other's best friend, confidant, lover, teacher, listener, and critic. Marriage deepens and enriches every facet of life. Happiness is fuller. Memories are fresher, commitment is stronger, even anger is felt more strongly, but passes away more quickly. When two people pledge their love and care for each other in marriage, they create a spirit unique unto themselves which binds them closer than any spoken or written word. Marriage is a promise, a potential, made in the hearts of two people who love each other, and it takes a lifetime to fulfill. Well, Kyle and Melanie, from this day on, may you always communicate openly and honestly with each other and live these days of joy. May you live in each other's company in peace and trust. And may your days be filled with the rewards that all that you've endured to bring you to this place. May you endlessly delight in each other and love and fulfill each other always. And now, because you have chosen each other in love and freedom, and have declared your purpose before the world and this gathering, and have made your pledges to one another by the authority vested in me by the province of Ontario, and in the midst of a global pandemic, it is my privilege to pronounce you husband and wife together. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> so Paul and Amy, if you're with us, we'll come inside. In the towers? Or in the towers? Oh, okay. you can not stay right there.
Well, thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for coming today. What a beautiful afternoon, and what a great-looking bride and groom. Wow, amazing. And it is my great honor and privilege now to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Kyle and Melanie Mocha. Can I give this to mom and dad here? Thank you guys, congratulations. Thank <laughs> you. 